it just keeps going down, down, down. But if we could just hold 50 cents, guys, what's going to happen? Hello, everyone. Hope you guys are having amazing XRPs around 56, 57 cents here, right? Definitely in the red, guys. I mean, when you want to place buy orders or whenever you want to buy these crypto currencies you don't want to buy them in green days guys right when everything's pumping that's when everyone film was in you you rather buy them in red days right because you're getting them at a discount most definitely now uh, as i was saying guys if, if xrp can just hold 50 cents which i think it will um there's going to be a hidden bullish divergence on the daily chart guys which is going to be very beautiful indeed which means there's going to definitely be a pump on the horizon i'm thinking it's going to be this month the reason being is because from whale alert 1 billion, another billion USDT minted at Tether Treasury. When you look at that, guys, right? They're literally non-stop printing. This is what I wanted to see. Again, the pump will be glorious, guys. Okay, not financial advice, first things first. But while the markets are dumping, it seems like Tether is trying to come and save the day, right? They're like the Fed, guys, the Federal Reserve. Um, and what's funny is the crypto market, the only market that's, that's excited about inflation guys is the cryptocurrency market right because they print there's usually a three-day delay as well so watch out for that so they print yesterday and they print it today what does that mean guys well the more tether prints the higher bitcoin goes right it's that simple the formula is literally clear guys tether prints which is um this orange line okay and look what happens to bitcoin's price guys right bitcoin's price literally is up it is going upwards, right? It's that simple, guys. It's up to the right until the collapse, in my opinion, not for each vice. Please like today's video, guys, because things are about to get quite interesting here, okay? Now, guys, we're going to have part of XRP in the XRP community. Now, this is kind of quite interesting. Why? Because perhaps a pump to 77K, right? Ripple Riddler, a, a Riddler back in the day, guys, tweeted uh, um, 17 green, 77 is red, okay? Now, this could have pertained towards XRP's price action, right, from the SEC lawsuit, but, which, which is quite crazy, right, but maybe a connection towards Bitcoin as well. We may have to pay attention to that, guys. Now, two weeks ago, Bitcoin was going to a gazillion dollars, guys, right? Now, crypto Twitter is saying the bull market is done. Crypto Twitter is more, uh, that's how emotions work, guys, right? This is how they play on your emotions, guys. This is how they get you out. It's because whenever there's green candles, guys, that's when there's greed, right? Everyone just chases the market. But whenever there's red, people just flee, right? People dump, guys. It makes no, it makes literally no sense, right? In a bull market, the best strategy is to hold, right? On, sit on your hands, guys, and not do anything at this point in time because... If you make one wrong mistake or wrong uh, one wrong move, guys, it's it's game over for you. Basically, right, you're you're going to get left behind. So, there we go. Now, since we're we're, uh, we're done talking about Bitcoin, guys, what about XRP though? Because the bear market is almost over. That's what it seems like to me, guys. Right, the charts suggest it is, and it's 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 weird. It's it's just strange, guys. Because three years later, we see on four twenty two, guys, on April twenty second, right, that's around the Bitcoin having as well. Look at this. Good night, sleep tight. Right, sleep tight. Good night and sleep tight, guys. The big bear, the mama bear, take it with a grain of salt. Um, the baby bear didn't definitely doesn't want to go to sleep. So the mama bear is like, it's time, right? It's time for us to go hibernate and let the bulls come out to play. That's what it seems like to me. It seems like XRP will have its first heartbeat possibly soon, right? In a couple weeks. 1221 mr pool tweeted out this guys right maybe that's when xrp starts awakening right i'm pretty sure this isn't financial advice once again guys but i'm pretty sure xrp bottomed out at 49 cents and we literally called that right because of the hidden bullish divergences guys on the on the higher time frames right on the two weekly now the simpsons never miss as well april is the month is it guys right april which points towards this as well as people pointed out, that's XRP's logo, guys, right? And that's her name tag right there. We see liquidity in the background, guys, right? And you want to what? Ride the waves, right? You want to ride it, guys. You want to just hold, not trade, per, per se. Wow. 
Interesting, guys. Interesting different perspectives, right? But in the end, we're waiting for this one catalyst to come to an end, okay? Or to spark so it trickles and has a domino effect into XRP's price moving up. Why? Because now we have to talk about the case. The SEC typically collects 11% of unregistered sales claims, but in Ripple, in Ripple case, they want 300%, guys. This is what abuse of power looks like. Wow, this is ridiculous, guys, right? Okay, I'm done. So this just means um, if you're on their side, guys, right, you're good to go because check this out. We got Kick Interactive, 100 million for unregistered sales, but then for remedies, um, was 5 million, right? They wanted 5 million. Then for Telegram Group Inc, unregistered sales, 1.7 billion. But they wanted 1.2. Um, library, 11 million was unregistered sales, guys. But they only wanted 111,000, right? Thor Technologies, 2.6 million. They wanted one. Um, over here, 147 million. They wanted 30, guys. Or for remedies, right? And then Ripple, 728 million, and they want about 2 billion, 1.95 billion, guys proposed by the SEC, right? This is just crazy to me, right? This is just laughable, guys. This is how we know for a fact, right? Not financial advice. They're not paying this amount, guys. They're not paying this amount. They're probably going to pay like 200 million, 300 million, right? Or maybe 589. Imagine, just imagine. Whatever the number uh, at that point be, guys, right? Whatever the number may be, it's going to be very significant to say the least, right? Very, very indeed. Now, the month, the month of May is important, guys, because April tells the story of Ripple and the SEC back in court. This three-year-old riddle nailed it. We are living in it now. A settlement could come in this month, but looking at key for May, XRP has a uh, breakthrough next month, be it settlement with SEC or a positive ruling from Judge Torres, right? So in that case, we have to talk about, um, wow, there's a huge threat, guys. We may possibly talk about this on another video, but... The reason being why April is important, look what's happening this month, guys, right? Again, pertaining towards the case. Now, next month, April, though, April goes towards May 22nd, right? Maybe perhaps the case ends here soon. That's what they're waiting for, guys. That's what it seems to be, right? Look at this, guys. Recall that the trial between the two ent entities is set for April 23rd, right? There's a lot of days to watch out for, uh, for in the uh, incoming weeks and months. But something will definitely spark XRP's price to go up. What will it be? Comment down below. Not to mention, final countdown slash um, tie related one removed, right? So the final countdown has been removed, guys. But the person who tweeted this out, right? The final countdown. Um, and Big Short liked that tweet. He said he just deleted the tweet, guys. Right? So that's that's um, interesting. Now, is it perhaps a final countdown? Right. That that's what Big Short supposedly um, points towards. It perhaps could be the reason being. I would say it may be, guys. It's because from the charts, right? Strictly from the charts. If we look at it, guys, back in 2017, if we follow the fractal, what happens next? Let's see. The fractal points towards a dump, and we just had it, guys, right? After this dump is done and over with, guys, what comes next? 73 cents is the target, right? Around this price, guys. Why is that weird? Because someone ha literally cracked the code. Okay, so if not maybe perhaps not this, guys, but maybe this could be a W. Sure seems like it will be, right? Um, but what's even crazier, guys, right? That's a bullish pattern. But get, get, this is insane, guys. Look at this. This is ridiculous. Seven years, two weeks, two days later, the circle is complete. What is this, guys? Look at this. Wow. It doesn't get more clearer than this, okay? It doesn't get more clear than this, guys, because we see this, this type of triangle pattern, guys, right? And XRP is bouncing within it, guys. Once it breaks through, once it, when, X, when XRP breaks this pattern, that's when it skyrockets. 
Look what's happening literally right now. This was back in 2017, right? March of 2017. Look now. Wait, what? Is that not the same damn pattern, guys? <laughs> what is that? So if we're bouncing, guys, right? Next up, again, 70-ish cents, right? What comes next is a dump, perhaps a little bit low, guys, and then up we go, right? It's the same patterns repeating. That's strange, if you ask me. Hmm, right? Again, there's a bunch of support at these levels, guys. So don't fade the idea of it pumping, right? All these indicators or charts are pointing towards the same thing, guys. Up, right? We broke out of the. This is on the monthly, which is insanity. We broke out of out of the resistance, guys. I've been holding XRP since 2021, and now we're just holding um, these levels as support, right? Once this correction is completed, guys, 100%. This this is what comes next. It's just guaranteed from, from just from charting itself, guys. Right from the technical analysis side of things. Um. But this is on the longer term as well, guys. This points towards double digits imminent, right? But remember, when XRP moves, guys, it, it, it won't let you get in, right? If you're in, you're in. Look how fast it moves. That's how fast it moves, guys. And it, it consolidates, it stays, it plays dead for so long, and it moves very quickly as well, right? It happens each damn time. It does not let you get in. Again, prepare. Because even the Bitcoin analyst, guys, says XRP is ready to skyrocket about 9x, right, to $6. That's insane, guys. These, the Bitcoin folks are saying it's, it's XRP's time to shine, right, while the XRP community is fleeing. <laughs> make it make sense, guys, right? Everything's flipped on its head, it seems as. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Insane stuff. Well, perhaps it may be time. Why? Because the IMF, guys, the IMF came about saying the global average cost of sending $200 from one country to another was about $12.50 in the first quarter of 2023 or 6.25% according to the World Bank. Cheaper cross-border payment services would benefit people and the economies worldwide. Aha! Uh -huh. The IMF needs what to XRP, guys, right? Low-value cross-border payments can incur steep fees. Exactly. And imagine people sending uh, money back to their family, right? And, and now you have to go through fees and all sorts of stuff, guys. It's impossible, right? What solves this? Wow. People are saying Bitcoin Lightning fixes this. That's ridiculous, right? Wow, look at all these Bitcoin maxis, guys. Wow. But we know what actually does. It's XRP, right? Not to mention this where the world turns into worse because bank, uh, central banks and the BIS test tokenization to improve exporter payments. Um... Which you, you, using tokenization, which involves uh, recording assets on the blockchain, has the advantage of combining messaging and settlement aspects of a payment in one transaction, guys. Uh huh. Right? This is where, again, everything points towards a new financial system, guys, doesn't it? On the Frick has partnered with MasterCard. Right? Card issuance. On the Frick. We are certified by Visa, MasterCard, and obviously Ripple is partnered with them as well, guys, right? To power. Africa's digital asset enable cross-border payments. Okay, guys, quickly, let's talk about Mr. Pool proofs. We see right here, Japan, prayers over there, guys, 100%. The water level is dropping rapidly, and apparently a tsunami, right? There's a, there's a lot of um, warning. Right? There's a lot of um, flashing red, guys, over there with natural disasters, right? And for Mr. Pool, and then we see... Uh, an earthquake strikes Taiwan, guys. Wow, right? What's happening within the world, guys? Doesn't it seem like the world is ending, right? With all the other things happening, and remember, this is around the same time as a solar eclipse, right? So again, which means more, more of these things will occur, guys. So just be ready, right, and prepare for anything possible. Um, wait, right? wait for Taiwan our next marker so let us prepare for the end guys because things are getting pretty hectic out here right in all different uh, in the world generally and in all markets prepare 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 not financial advice but anyways that's what amazing see ya